One of my clients today wanted a reading on what the election is all about, what it's going to bring for her, things like that, right? Um, and it was interesting how I was describing the messages that Spirit was telling me about this election. To me, there really isn't a reality where Kamala wins. I have not seen a single vision or alternate reality where like that exists. Even if ballot boxes are being burned, even if things are rigged, I don't see the outcome being Kamala either way. And this is what my spirit guides were telling me. Well, one, because God is real. God can switch a blue state to a red state. I'm not pro either side. I'm pro save the fucking children and dismantle all corruption, just to be clear. But God can shift that. God, the power of prayer is legit real. We saw it in the hurricane. And I kind of had this little epiphany that most red states or people who vote that way really believe in Christ and the power of prayer. And then most blue are pretty anti-Christ or anti-religion. And I think that has a big deal, has a big part in this um, race. Because this is not an election like we've ever seen before, we're actually seeing how humans can manipulate energy. We're seeing that this is just a game. They're all just puppets on stage, both sides, right? But we're seeing that we can actually influence it by our thoughts, our energies, and our prayers. So the power of prayer is pretty vital in our existence as humans on earth but we're seeing it really in this election now and my kind of theory is because red states or red people tend to be so christian based or um just like really believe in a god that this sort of is shining through in this election because in the past we were not ascended to a level of consciousness that we are now because the Pluto return had to come and enter the United States. It had to hit where it needed to be astrologically. The Pluto return changed this. In the past, we could not see this way. We could not see the truth. Now, everything that Kamala is posting, everything that um, all the people she's bringing on stage, it's laughable because they're all involved in the P. Diddy stuff, right? That's not something we would be aware of in the past. We have raised our level of ascension. That's why this election is different than all the others, and this is why our future elections will never look the same. Like, this might be our last, like, traditional one. Not in the sense of, like, they're gonna get rid of governments and voting, um, but there's just gonna be so much exposure happening that, like, humans are gonna start thinking for themselves. Like, it's about time. But yeah, that's just kind of like a little bit what I got in my reading with my client today. And I just found it super interesting. And yeah, just sort of thinking about like the red and blue states and how oftentimes it's stereotypically um, red states tend to be more Christian based and blue states tend to be more uh, liberal or, or um, anti. So I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. That's just a little theory I have besides the, the channeled messages from my spirit guides. But um, I found that a little interesting.